Edgetune has been manufacturing ski and snowboard sharpening equipment, mostly for the racing community, since the turn of the century. Well, 2001 that is. And this season we're introducing our best tool yet, the Edgetune Pro Model 2, featuring ball bearing guides, all stainless steel hardware, ceramic grinding stone. It's a professional quality tool designed to last a lifetime. The setup is very simple. First, we choose our bevel angle, and you can see the bracket is stamped with a three, two, or one degree side bevel. Three degrees would be for racers, two degrees is for most skiers, and one degree for novice. The key to a great edge grind is a ceramic grinding stone that's a fine grit that generates no heat. I'm gonna take our stone and put it into the collet of our Dremel. I'm gonna tighten it with the key supplied. And I'm gonna dress it. Let's put on our safety glasses. This stone has been used and you can see a proper wear mark from some of the grinding material. I'm gonna show you how the dressing stone cleans that up. It's also important to hold the dressing stone perfectly flat across the top of the stone, which makes it perfectly square and accurate for the bevel angles. And that's all there is to it. And now you have a new stone. To assemble the Dremel, we simply screw it onto the bracket and tighten it down like so. And you can see that it falls to hand beautifully, making a very nice balance. Now we're going to set our adjustment screws so that they're just even with the ceramic stone. And we can do that by resting it on the ski like so, and turn them so that they're both equal. There's nothing fancy about this, just, just so that the, the stone is just barely kissing it. And then we're going to just tighten this forward slightly so that the stone is lifted up ever so slightly off the, off the edge. Okay. Now we're going to set our ski up. We put the ski brake holders on the rubber bands, and we've used a simple little vice here. You don't need any real sophisticated fancy holding equipment. Uh, some people have sharpened skis in their hotel room or even in the back of their car. Now we're ready to grind our edge. I'm going to use the marker pen and highlight the edge just so I can see where we've done the full grind cleanup. And this is a good idea to do it at least the first time or two on a on a ski just to make sure that the bevel angle is in fact what you thought it was. Uh, remember the edge tune design is fixed bevel angles and they're very accurate. So now uh, we're going to creep up on the grind. So I've got the adjuster screws set to where the stone just barely kisses the edge. And you'll be able to see that just that was enough to provide pretty much a full edge cleanup and a remarkable improvement in surface finish. I'm going to take one more pass. And there you have it. That's all there is to it. And the first thing people say when they feel this edge is, oh wow. It is. This, is. this is an incredible edge. And you saw how fast and easy it was. And the surface finish is phenomenal. There is nothing more you need to do with this edge. Leave it as ground. Once we've ground the edge, it'll throw a slight burr across the base edge, which is good, because that's how you create the sharpest edge possible, by displacing material. And now to remove the burr, we're going to use the fine 600 grit diamond stone included in the kit. A World Cup tuner taught me this, that what you want to do to remove that burr is very gently run the tool along. You don't need any guides or anything. Let your hand feel it and let the diamond do the work. You shouldn't have to put any force on a diamond stone. And you'll feel it, you can hear it, just picking up that burr. And that's all you want to do is just kiss that edge to remove that burr. 
Now let's see how good this edge really is. So in summary, the Edge Tune Pro 2 is a professional grade tool with outstanding edge sharpness, it's easy to use, and it'll last a lifetime. Thanks for tuning in and stay sharp.